gonna explain to you how to wire up a light fixture that I just purchased off the internet. And most of these are made in China and you end up with a blue wire and a brown wire. The blue wire goes on to the white wire that are our American normal um, electrical wires. And the brown wire goes to the black. And if I wire these up and put a light bulb on this, it would turn so on. Remove the, uh, the old style light fixture that was on the wall. And I'm going to hang three pendant lights from the ceiling. They're like a round glass ball, but I have to go into the attic and I've already marked where I want them, drilled a hole, and I've stuck the wire in there. I need to splice all three of them together, which means all three of the blue wires go together, all three of the brown wires go together. And once I have that, all I do is feed my electrical line all the way in the attic and I splice them up and do all my work in there. And that way when you hit the switch, all of them will turn Simple. right up. If you guys have a standard light fixture that you purchased in the US or if it has a white wire and a black wire, all you do is hook up and splice your white wire to the black wire and there's your ground. That's what this one is. So that goes to the usually green, oh, screw. painted green screw right there. That's where your ground would go. This is also a ground wire right here. You can put those together on the screw. Um, you got your black and your white. And so you see how these four, four lights that I have on this fixture, they're all just tied together to the white, to the black. Make sure you use a wire to nut. splice them all together. Just weave them together. Also make sure that your power is turned on before you get started. You don't want to get zapped. So I got all the wires wired up and I wired them up in the ceiling. Explain to you guys really quick, quickly what I did is I used this blue wire that's just pretty thick. And what I did is I made a really long one going, all of them were going there. So the two wires were going all the way there. These two wires were going all the way here. And these two wires in here tapped into the line that I added, which is a thick line. And what I did is wire nut them all together in that area right there. So again, wire going from here to here, wire going from here to here, because I wanted to keep these long, so I added a wire to it. So everything got tapped in right here to the third one and to the main wire. You see that yellow wire in the wall because I had to get around a two by four that's in the wall. So all of them tapped into there going down and into there and we're gonna push this, all that jumbled mess into the wall and drywall it. And then I'll have my three hanging pending lights all set. So I hope this video helps you out and explains to you on what needs to be done to change from a standard light fixture, which was like this, and going to hanging pending lights in your bathroom. So thanks for watching. Hope this video helps you out.